What makes us Democrats is that we understand policy is not abstraction. That there's a human soul behind our policy choices. There's a human being behind every one of those line items in our budgets. There is a, an aspirant, somebody with hopes, dreams, struggles, who is not looking for government to solve every problem in their life, who just wants government to help them help themselves. That's what makes us Democrats. That is why I am proud to support this movement. And that is who the next governor of the Commonwealth of Massachusetts will be. A Martha Coker. for those 17,000 kids waiting to get early education. We know how important it is. Waiting. Folks who don't have our sick time, most of us don't worry about that, but a lot of people in Massachusetts do. That's important to people. And that says what I care about, what you care about, what we care about as Democrats. That we want to make sure we give every kid an opportunity to find his dream and follow it. And I was talking today up in Lynn about this kid I met at the Lynn Vocational Technical School. I said, I met this kid. He was a real kid, by the way. <laughs> I met this kid in Lynn, and he never thought he would go to college. But he told me in his senior year, he had a four-year scholarship, electrical engineering, to Bucknell. And he was so excited because he was getting the education here in Massachusetts that was going to give him that opportunity. <laughs> My dad went to college, worked his way through college. I got to go to law school, my mom never even got to go to college. I know, and you know, that the key to turning this around, not just for the people in Massachusetts, because that's the right thing to do, good education, opportunity, to go to a two-year school, a four-year school, everybody should have that chance. And you know what the best news is? When we do that, it means we're investing in their future and our future. Because right. we're gonna keep jobs here because we have the workforce to do them.